just bugging. Hey, what do we got here? Carmagia. What year is it, Sam? 70. 70. He's the ugly one. Right. So all this was welded in, needs to be finished, of course. Right. Um, and then the same thing on the back, this is where we really got heavy into Remember this, this big tail lines? Yeah. We cut those out and put the French in the, uh, whatever you call it, in this earlier stage. Uh-huh. And so, you got the parts, we cut the new, you know, new carburetor and everything inside there. Shot when you're done with it. Yeah, it's a tip piece here place there. Yeah. This is the new muffler and the exhaust and all that stuff is in here. Mm-hmm. I've got it locked. Oh, I've got it locked, okay. This can just be cut off. Yeah, okay, but it's cheaper to just buy one of these. You yeah, it's even cheaper you just to find one. for like 40 bucks. Yeah, and it's just easier to find one than to deal with that. The other one that I had, I was thinking about cutting it if I wanted to keep that patina. Uh, but since you're going to paint it, yeah. you just get another yeah, one. Yeah, yeah. Do you have this patch panel or no? No, I do not have this patch panel. I've got, you can buy them from right here. Mm -hmm. Or right here, whatever it is. Yeah, I'm sure. Down and cut I haven't done a Carmagia yet. I've been looking forward to doing one. This side, this, this side had more of the rust because the lady that I bought it from rolled the window down just slightly, parked it next to a tree, and left it. So the Is water there any pan and work already done to it? Brand new pans in it. Okay. And they're dynamited. Okay. Um, the tray in the back, down the back here, the $200 piece that needs to be cut out. <laughs> it had small holes in it when I pulled the carpet. Right. And as I picked at it, it just got it just right. spread, so I just kind of started cutting and getting it out. So I was going to replace that, and then the, the, some of these side pieces. Yeah, the dash pack goes over that. I mean, I can patch those in and not be concerned about the cosmetics of it. And, if you want to keep and put that, the I dash put, panel over it. I put inside here the 62 dashboard. He's got a whole different oh, dashboard. Got the if one. you want it. Oh, okay. Yeah. Well, I mean, I was, easy. Yeah, I think it'd be The glass has got to come out anyways for a paint job. I think it'd be a lot easier just to fix this if you want to keep it the same right. dash. Put the pad back over it. Yeah, it yeah that's what I say. Yeah. Because then you're not screwing up with all the wiring mm -hmm. and everything else. I talked to Nicole this morning. He didn't have one in stock, but she said she could order it. Mm -hmm. Right. The front bumper is inside right there. Okay. These are brand new carbs, dual carbs in that box there. The steering wheel was our chosen. What, dual, yeah, what size carbs are they? You know? They're just a single because it's a uh, single port mode. Okay. So it's supposed to be a little bit. Cool. All your trim pieces are right here. Uh -huh. all, all the pieces are here. Yeah, we'll go through it all. Here's your generator and stuff. There's tons of parts and stuff in here and here and all over. Okay. Uh, I've seen people take these and just do them painted. That's I don't really care for that look, but if you like it, that's, you know, well, you can do those. We just keep our eyes open for, you don't have the front one. bring those two from up top. Oh, yeah. If you want those. The nose isn't that bad of shape. the engine here? Yeah, single port. Yeah. I hate it. Um, Even though you used to preach I now. used to do it. <laughs> Pick it up there and steer it just to make sure, James. I can steer it just to make sure. Yeah, open up. Forge it. Yes. Yeah. Now, now you can straighten it back out. That's fine. Yeah, that's not going to go anywhere. There we go. Perfect. Yeah, you can cut it down from. Um, you have to go on the inside. Oh, so it does have front bumper. Yeah, it's the front bumper. And actually, if you go with that patina, you won't have to go with that. Oh, OK. 
Okay. You want to cut out that little section? Yeah, I can do that. That's that new piece. I was just going to replace the rust areas and keep the old patina. Yeah, I, I had to do something like this, and it was a pain on the 54 Victoria I did. I just split the entire driver's door and put it back, and the car was painted black. So you couldn't even tell, but it, it took a lot of hours to do. I love this look. Ooh. Yeah. Well, that's nice. That's sweet. Yeah. I, I'm not sure I'm going to put it in there, but... Oh, I would. You got a whole yard of beetles, huh? Oh, they don't bother me. That's hey, so see, we we restore beetles and then we we, we pet beetles. We be friend to them. <laughs> yeah. The beetle wants to see the gear. Yeah, see, the beetle wants to see the gear. <laughs> All right. Hold on. Turning. Yeah. Sweet. Hey guys, it's Dalton. Thanks for watching this short little video of the introduction of the 1970 Ghia. The owner of the 1970 convertible yellow beetle that we made a video on in the past bought this, which is now having us to restore it. If you guys like the video, drop a like, comment, subscribe, and have a just bug in every day.